Peace children. Hope you all are fine and staying safe at home. Now, we will be starting today with exercise 1.2 of chapter number 1. Exercise 1.2 is problem based exercise where all our problem sums involving basic mathematical operations. With basic mathematical operations, I mean addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. But they are all problem based questions. Normally in class 6, problem based questions come for section C and section D. That means they carry 3 marks or 4 marks depending upon the length of the uh, question. When the question comes for 4 marks, each and every step carries marks and it is important for us to write each and every step. I repeat, in section C and section D, where the question comes for 3 marks and 4 marks, every step becomes compulsory to be written. Each and every step carries marks. Now let's come to the question. A book exhibition was held for four days in a school. There is a school which had organized a book exhibition and that exhibition was for four days. The number of tickets sold at the counter on the first, second, third and final day was respectively 1094, 1812, 2050 and 2751 means the ticket sold at the counter on the first day was 1094 on the second day was 1812 on the third day was 2050 and on the fourth day that is the final day 2751 so we must underline the figures given to us Find the total number of tickets sold on all the four days. What we have to find? The total number of tickets sold. When we are finding the total number of tickets sold, that means in our mind we know that the operation to be done is addition. But as I told you in the beginning, this being a problem sum, each and every step is compulsory to be written. So this is how we run. Tickets sold, tickets sold on first day, how many tickets are sold? 1094. On second day, It is 1812. Here we will write 1's under 1's, 10's under 10's, 100 under 100 and 1000 under 1000. On third day, two thousand fifty tickets were sold. Again the same way, 1's will always come under 1's. Tens under tens, hundred under hundred, and thousand under thousand. And on the fourth day, two thousand seven hundred fifty one tickets were sold. Now we need to find total tickets. Total tickets means we are going to add and always in addition we start adding the ones places first. 4 plus 2, 6 plus 1 becomes 7. 9 plus 1, 10 and 10 becomes 20. 0 down, 2 carry over. 2 plus 8, 10. 10 plus 7 becomes 17. 7 down, 1 carry over. 1 plus 1, 2, 2 plus 1, 3, 3 plus 2, 5, 5 plus 2, 7. So how many total tickets are sold? 7,707. Therefore, 7,707 tickets were sold in all. 
Now, see each and every step. This first step, if you write correctly, you get half mark. Second step, half. Third step, half. Fourth step, half. The total carries one mark. So, in this way, the question will be divided. So, practice accordingly. Thank you.